I'm having my pumpkin coffee this morning, and look who's waiting. He loves coffee and YouTube. Hi honeybees, it's Sunday, and I washed my hair last night. It's all naturally curly today. And we're gonna go to Pier 1 and Kohl's today because I need to get my aunt a gift. And then Pier 1 had a coupon, so we're just gonna go there. Um, this half top is from American Eagle Outfitters. Then I just have a gray tank on and some yoga pants from Victoria's Secret. Um, I have this ring on that a subscriber gave me. Isn't it awesome? And then my earrings are from... You know what? I'm not sure where these are from. I think these were from a boutique. They're just little mint earrings. My lipstick combo is L'Oreal Ferris Nude. And then this lip gloss or lip gloss from MAC or Dazzle Glass, sorry. I can't see the number because it's in white and it's really small, but it's this really pretty pink Dazzle Glass. Came from a holiday set. My blush is Tickled Pink again from e.l.f. NYC Bronzer again and Sunny. My foundation today is the Jouer. I think that's how you say it. Um, tinted moisturizer, the matte oil-free one. And then concealer is MAC Pro Longwear. My eye look is really neutral. I just did cork in the crease and I used the Fergie highlighter, the pink one. I think it's called Dazzle Light on my lid. And then I have, I look really glowy today. It's starting to get hot here. My brows are Anastasia pomade in dark brown. My lashes are Tarte Slight Camera Lashes and Tight Line Mascara for my bottom lashes. Um, I feel like I'm extra glowy right there. I put some highlight. Oh, my highlight is from Hourglass. It's the Dim Light. Is it Dim Light? Diffuse Light. It is. I think that's it. I put a little bronzer stuff on my chest too to kind of even everything out. My arms are kind of white. And yeah, that's pretty much it. And I'll show you if we go anywhere exciting or show you what I get afterwards. Hey guys, so they have these beautiful cards at Hallmark right now from Sarah Jessica Parker. And they all have like these glitter accents to them. There's so much beautiful detail to it. This one's a birthday one. And see it has all this bling detail on the inside. If you can see that. So there's one. And then there's this one. Her dress is all sparkly. This one's so me. And then on the inside, it has these pretty sparkly polka dots. Oh, sorry. <laughs> there, we can see it now. Okay. And they all have really pink, pretty pink envelopes with a, some have gold, some have black in the inside. So pretty. And then there's this one. This one's my favorite. With the macaroons and they're glittery. I don't know if I'm giving this card away. <laughs> it's so pretty I can't and then this is the inside and then I got a first communion card for my cousin because I'm going there for his communion soon and then a wedding card because I'm going to a wedding next month okay guys so we're back home now I didn't film at Kohl's so I just wanted to show you what I got and I'm going to share this in a haul too at least these two items or these three items um, so I got a pair of black pants for under 20 bucks on sale since I'm going to be starting my new job I need some more slacks I'm kind of wearing out the other ones I have and so I just got a really nice comfy pair and I think it's called curvy fit which they fit me perfectly probably because they're called curvy fit so <laughs> They're really, really nice and soft. I got this set for my aunt. Her birthday's coming up next month, and I really love this scent. It's the Poppy Flower from Coach, and it's the lotion and perfume set. I think it was 45 bucks, and we had Kohl's cash, by the way, so that's why I got all this good stuff. But So I'm going to send that out to her soon. 
I found the Real Technique sponge at Kohl's and I was so happy. It was just six bucks and I've been hearing some really great reviews on this that it's pretty comparable to the Beauty Blender. So I think if you guys want me to do a review on this, I will. I'm going to try it out this week and see what I think. Um, so I was able to use my Kohl's cash with everything here, even the real technique stuff. So just keep that in mind. Um, I got this really pretty Easter kind of looking dress from the Lauren Conrad collection. Let's see if I can zoom in Lauren, but I just loved the beautiful coloring of this. And in the back, it has like a little bit of a cut out on the top and then it just really pretty. It's very nice. And, um, conservative on the front no cleavage um and then it just kind of flares out so i thought this would be a really perfect church easter dress or i'm going to be going to my cousin's first communion and i thought this would be a really nice classy pretty spring dress i love the lauren conrad collection and then i got this top and it was in the juniors area and it's from the company rewind and i got this in a large and it's just a really gorgeous lace detail to it and it's a cream backing it looks really cute on I'm gonna have to put these on and show you guys but I love it and I think I got it for like 12 bucks 10 bucks and that's all I got at Kohl's good morning honeybees I'm off to work and I thought I'd show you my makeup real quick um today I'm wearing the Misha BB cream as my base and then the naked skin foundation from Urban Decay in number three my lip combo is the NYX retractable lip liner in hot pink and then the lip butter from Revlon in Gumdrop number 60. So it's more like the Radiant Orchid color of the year. Um, on my eyes, I have Lavish Lavender Eye Tattoo as my base. And then the L'Oreal Infallible Shadow in Burst into Bloom. My inner tear duct is a Lorac shadow from their Black Lace Palette. My earrings are from Target. They're rose gold bows and then I have this HRH bracelet that's in rose gold and silver HRH collection I should say um, cheeks I have tickled pink from elf and then contour is max nude on board bronzer <clears throat> um, setting powder is tar Amazonian clay foundation powder foundation and my brows are Anastasia brow pomade which I think they're kind of off today but I don't have time to fix them my liner is Jordana liquid liner in black my lashes are lights camera lashes from Tarte and Max um, Oat I don't know if it's just I forget it's H-O-U-T-E something I don't know something like that it has the two different tops that you screw that are purple um, yeah so I think that's it I did something a little bit different, like more brighter today, and it's mostly drugstore. So let me know if you like it. And I did a cat wing today. Hey, what are you doing, Boo? Hmm? Looking for some food? My mom just made tortilla, so he's by our side. Oh, that's a big knife. This is Spanish tortilla. I think I've shown you this before. It's egg, potato, and chorizo, which is a Spanish sausage. It's really bomb, 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 bomb. But the reason I'm filming right now is because I wanted to show you, look at these stunners right here. Amazing, amazing, especially that middle one. It reminds me of Blue Brown Pigment from MAC, but it's not, it is from Prestige. It's this shadow right here, the Total Intensity shadow in Hocus Pocus. Absolutely stunning, and you can find these at Ulta. And then the lighter golden shade right there is this one here. It's like a pinky gold. And it's in Spellbound. And then the copper shade is copper from the True Metals eyeshadows. And then I got this lip liner from them too in Angora. So I'm just so excited to do tutorials with these and play with them. They're stunning. Hi guys, so I just wanted to show you my makeup real quick. I just filmed Friday Favorites a bit early this week since I will be so busy the rest of the week. And I'm about to meet up with Crystal here on YouTube. I'm going to link her channel right here. We're going to go shopping at the Chandler Mall. I can't wait to meet her. Well, we've met before at my store, but we haven't hung out before. So my lip combination today is Estee Lauder Spice Lip Liner with Nude Beach Lipstick from Too Faced La Creme Line. Love that lipstick. Um, my foundation today is the Naked Skin from Urban Decay in shade number 3, as well as the Tarte Amazonian Clay Powder as my setting powder. 
My amazing, like, glow to my skin is the NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer. Love that little baby, and I'm in shade light number two. My contour is Nude On Board Bronzer from MAC, and blush is Rose, or Pink Rose Blush from Maybelline, the highlight blushes that just came out. And my eye look today is from the Too Faced Chocolate Bar Palette. I'm going to show you the actual palette in a second here and point to the shades I used. But I'm thinking about doing a tutorial, so let me know if you would like me to do that in the future. I really, I just was playing around today and this is the look that I came up with and I really like it. My mascara is the Hot and Naughty Mascara from MAC and IT Cosmetics Tightline Mascara from my bottom lashes. Brow Pomade in Dark Brown from Anastasia for my brows. And I think that's it. Um, my earrings are from Forever 21, and my top is from TJ Maxx. It's this long sleeve, very kind of see-through, sheer um, lace top, but I'm not going to be wearing this out. It was just for filming, and I have my hair in a little bun because it's cray. It's naturally curly still today, and I need to wash it, so I'm just going to leave it up. So yeah, that's my makeup, and I will film when I'm with Crystal later. So for this look, I used this one all over the lid, which is Black Forest Truffle. This one is my highlight in Champagne Truffle in my inner tear duct. Outer corner is Triple Fudge, this one here. And then in my, oop! And in my crease, I used Salted Caramel, this kind of tan, warm brown there. Hi guys, so I'm so sorry I didn't vlog um, with Crystal. I totally failed on that. I wasn't even thinking. We were just talking and shopping and having fun and I just totally blanked on vlogging. So I'm so sorry. But definitely check out her channel because she's really sweet and we had fun shopping. Just makeup shopping as usual. <laughs> I got two things from Sephora because they had Bobbi Brown at this Sephora and we don't have that at my location. So I got a shadow from Bobbi Brown and I got my Laura Mercier powder that I've been wanting. We've been out of the shade at my Sephora for a long time now, so I needed it. Needed it. Do you see how I, I do that? Yeah. And then I got a lipstick at Chanel. It's the Shine line. I think it's Shine. Just call it Coco Shine in the color Boy. And I'm pretty sure Kristen Game here on YouTube was the one that made me want that and there was also a beautiful taupe shadow but I told myself I do not need another one right now at least because <laughs> I'm really bad at hoarding shadows and not using them so I really need to work on that um, but I'll show you them in a haul soon I'm not gonna show them on the vlog today I'm about to go get me some Jamba juice right now though because I don't know why but I've been thinking about it and it's hot today it's 90 degrees I have like a buy one get one free so I'm gonna get my mom one too and that's about it for right now Talk so I wish I had done a before and after but I decided to clean the pantry today because it was crazy unorganized when I get my own apartment mine's gonna be super super organized but I thought I'd just give you a, a quick little view so these are like our whole green crackers my Belvita breakfast things like nuts and snacks then those are like the chips and pretzels cereals then this is my little cupboard I wish that this would be a little brighter but there's no light in the pantry but anyways these are my kind bars are all in this little jar I'll bring it out so you can see and my little like teas and stuff are all in that And then I have like my all natural honey, my PB2, my agave nectar, and then these are some quinoa and brown rice. This is like a smoothie. And then I have my oatmeal, just raw oats, and then just plain oatmeal in packets. I love this little basket for organizing. And then these are the rest of the cabinets that I just. That one's a mess still. It's baking stuff and I'm just like not touching it. <laughs> so anyways, just thought I'd show you real quick how I was, what I was doing for the last hour. If you guys are looking for a pretty low calorie yummy treat, I'm making um, sugar free banana pudding little pies. They're mini graham cracker crusts and these are 110 calories a piece. You can get them in a pack of six at the grocery store. This is what they look like before I fill them. I cut up one banana. And then this is two boxes of the small boxes of the sugar-free Jello banana pudding. 
Um, or you can just get one big box, but we only had two little boxes. And then once you're done putting the pudding and bananas in here, I layer them like one layer bananas, pudding, bananas, pudding. And then you can put Cool Whip on top and it's about 160 calories per, per little pie crust, mini pie. Well, and here is what they look like when they're filled. And it's about two heaping tablespoons fit in the little pie crust. I have a little bit left, but I'll just put that in a little container. But that's what they look like. Yum, yum, yum. This is the purse I'm now wearing. It's from Just Fab. The lining is this really pretty stripe, brown and white stripe. And it's just one big pocket. This little zipper compartment there and a little side pocket. I really like it so far. The only thing I don't like is that I can only carry it on my arm. I can't put it on my shoulder, and it's kind of heavy. But it's really cute. Obviously, I love the color. And there's this little key ring thing, too. I have another purse I got from them, too, but that will be in my haul. I painted my nails with this Zoya polish in the color Sweet, which is this really pretty pale bubblegum pink. I think it's really pretty. I just filmed a haul, and it's kind of cray-cray right now. I just stuffed everything in this bag. <laughs> There's like a ton of makeup in there. But yeah, just got done filming that. I'm gonna show you my makeup now. Okay guys, I'm gonna show you my makeup real quick. Oh, first of all, my necklace is from Jewel Mint, and it's kind of crooked right now because I was cleaning up. But it's just this cute little locket. My earrings are from the JLo collection at Kohl's. And okay, so makeup I have on the CC cream from Cover Effects in Golden Light Medium. My setting powder is the Laura Mercier Smooth Finish Foundation Powder. It's awesome. Love it so much in shade number 5. Contour is Nude on Board Bronzer from MAC. Blush is... Uh, what the heck is my blush? Oh, it's the NYX Blush in Flamingo. It's this really beautiful blue-toned pink. And my highlight is from It Cosmetics. It's their only powdered highlighter so I forget the name of it. On my lips I have the Rouge Coco Shine from Chanel in the shade Boy and lip liner is Be Boldly Bare from MAC. Um, on my eyes, oh dear lordy, isn't this like a gorgeous shadow? It's the Bobbi Brown shadow in, I always forget the name, Velvet Plum number three. I just got it the other day. It's in my haul. And then in the crease I use Samoa Silk from MAC and then Embark also is closer to the lid area and in the outer corner from MAC, Embark from MAC. And then the inner corner highlight is from the Black Lace Palette from Lorac. It's just the white shade in that. There's no name to it. And my brows are Anastasia Pomade in Dark Brown. Uh, my liner is Rouge Bunny Rouge Liquid Liner. And then my lashes are Lights Camera Lashes from Tarte and the Natural Mascara in the Green Tube from Physicians Formula. And yeah, I think that's it. I straightened my hair because I just washed it last night. It's getting kind of long. I need to trim it though. I feel like my ends are a little dry. You've seen this shirt a zillion bajillion times. <laughs> I don't know why I just showed it again. <laughs> but I just wanted to show you my makeup real quick. And I'm going to go visit my aunt later. I didn't really go into this this week because it's sad. And no one wants to hear about sad things. But my great uncle. So I'm going to go visit my great aunt. Not my aunt. But he's in the hospital right now. He's not doing so well, guys. So prayers are definitely appreciated. He had like a, a blood clot in his leg that was going up to his heart. And it was scary. They had to put some kind of stent. And he had a surgery for that. And he's kind of losing it a little bit right now. I don't know why I whispered that. But yeah, it's just a hard time concerning that. I would... I went to visit him the other day and I totally lost it. I just started bawling afterwards because, I mean, you know, we're not super close, but I love him and it's really sad to see anyone have to go through that. And I think about my grandpa and my dad and if that was them, how I would feel. So I'm not going to talk about it anymore after this, but unless, you know, it's good news and I want to tell you that he's out of the hospital. But as of right now, he's still in the hospital recovering. So I'm going to go visit my great aunt to, with my mom just to give her a little support. Hi guys, it's Friday. I just got done editing a haul, a collective haul video, so that's now rendering. I just finished this watermelon lemonade candle. I'm kind of sad because it smells really, really good. I need a three wick of this. Love it. 
I'm watching some videos, catching up on some videos on my Comcast on my TV. And this is Kristen Game and her husband. I love their vlogs. Um, and then I'm doing some laundry, which I guess I could kind of show you, but I'm probably not going to. Oh, let's peek at Harley. And Harley is sleeping, baby. What happened? Oh, my goodness, a big stretch. Oh, wow, what a hard life. What a hard life as a pup. Right, baby? I wanted to show you, I used this Hail Nails sparkly polish on my ring finger here. This is my ring finger, right? Yeah. And it's really fun. I love it. It looks like, it feels and looks like gel glitter. And this is the color, I think, VVS. I got it in a Scratch It box, which is a nail subscription service. So I'll go ahead and link that for you guys. But it's really fun glitter. So I just filmed a tutorial using the Chocolate Bar palette from Too Faced. So that should be up probably next week sometime. Um, I used the It Cosmetics Bye Bye Redness and the Naked 3 or Naked Foundation from Urban Decay in shade number 3. And on my lips is Estee Lauder's Spice Lip Liner and NARS Chelsea Girl. And then as my blush, I have Pink Rose from Maybelline, their highlight blush. And then I also have Nude On Board Bronzer as my contour. And then my brows are the brow pomade. They're not perfect today, but whatever. And then my eye look is the Too Faced palette. And I'll have it up very soon. My little earrings are from the JLo collection at Kohl's. They're rose gold with little diamonds or diamantes. So now I'm going to film another video. Um, an unboxing of a swap I'm doing with Glam Mandy here on YouTube. I'm super excited to unbox it. I haven't, I have no idea what's in it. But I just got this from Vitacost. I got a big box from them this week, but this was missing out of it, so it got sent separately. It's the Organic Fiji Raw Oil Pineapple and Coconut. Oh, MG, this smells like a tropical vacation. It's so yummy, and it's very moisturizing. I just put it on my arms, and it gave a beautiful glow to my skin. Can't wait to use that for summer and spring when I go on vacation. Um, so yeah, now I'm going to go film the giveaway, or not the giveaway. Now I'm going to film the swap right now, and then I think we're going to go to dinner tonight as a family, so I need to get changed. What's going here today, the La Familia. It's a pizza place. We're gonna, <laughs> there's my parents. <laughs> it's supposed to be New York style, and we wanted to try out a new place again. We're still looking for the best pizzeria here. Hey honeybees, today is Saturday and I'm about to go to work in a few hours here, like an hour and a half. And today we had to do the Radiant Orchid look called Bird of Paradise. And we're all going to be wearing this. And it's definitely out of my comfort zone. I don't usually wear such bold, bright eyes. But I wanted to share with you since I usually don't wear something like this. So first off, foundation is the Urban Decay Naked Foundation in number three. My concealer is the Radiant... Um, what's it called? Just Radiant Concealer, I think, from NARS. Creamy Radiant Concealer in number light two. Light, light number two. My contour is Nude on Board from MAC. And then my blush is Radiant Magenta from the Hourglass New Blushes. My brows, I use the Tarte Mousse in, I think it's just called Brunette. Okay, so on to the eye look. So first of all, I used the Urban Decay palette that looks like this. Okay, so in this row here, I used the green underneath my eye and around the perimeter of the top lashes. And then I used this blue here, which is called Shattered, um, in the first third of my eye. And then the Radiant Orchid color that's in my crease and on like two thirds of the lid, that is actually a NARS blush. And it was a limited edition blush. It's just like a really hot pink. And so that's what I used. And I'll show you the actual look book too so you can see it's really close to it. I'm really happy about how it turned out. And then in the inner corner here, I also used another shade from this palette. It's called Cherry. It's this shade right here. 
so that palette definitely came in handy I got that off Outlook a while ago um, on my lips you're not even gonna believe this it's a Jane pH adjusting stain gloss and it adjusts to your pH in your lips and this is in the shade pink rose and I actually got this in my swap sneak peek I haven't posted the swap yet um, this is one of the things I got and we had to do like a very light lip with this but it still had to be um, a little bit close to the radiant orchid color so that's what I did on my lips I think that's it. Oh, my lashes. I have no liner on, and my lashes are Lights Camera Lashes by Tarte and the Natural Mascara from Physicians Formula in the green tube. So, yeah, that's it. And then I did a little bit of a, a braid that wraps around and goes down. Oh, lighting. Crazy lighting. And, yeah, that's it. My hair is straight, and then I'm off to work in a second here. I forgot to tell you guys my highlight is this really gorgeous rose gold highlight from Victoria's Secret. And it's called Next to Nude Illuminating Face Powder. And it's very close to the um, highlight from MAC that everyone really loved. I can't remember the name of it all of a sudden. That had that rose gold sheen. But it's really gorgeous. I love it. Hey guys, I forgot to tell you, the place last night was amazing. So if you live in Arizona, that's the place to go to get true New York style pizza. They actually import the water from the East Coast to here so that the bread is as good as the East Coast. Incredible. So, so good. We'll definitely be going back there. Um, they gave us free garlic nuts too. So sweet because they found out we were from Jersey. <laughs> um... But today I'm being super hardcore about my diet. I really need to get back on track fully. I haven't gained any weight. I just haven't been really trying to lose any more weight, which I do still need to. So today is a strict diet for me. And hopefully I'll continue progressing. And then I definitely plan on doing more health-related videos for you guys. Um, yeah, so if you want that, let me know. I do say like what I eat sometimes on my vlogs. But if you want me to do a video dedicated to that, let me know, and I'll do that in the future. Um, so yeah, just wanted to update you on that. Hey guys, so I'm home from work now, and I gotta say, I had a no good, very bad day. And I mean very bad. I don't want to get into it. But when I have a bad day, what do I do? Buy makeup. <laughs> so I got the color of the year Luster Cheek Sweet Palette. And this is what it looks like in the box. And I only paid 16 bucks for it because of my Sephora discount, but it's usually, I think, 26 And it's limited edition, and I definitely suggest it. Hold on. Okay, so it's really beautiful. It has a gradient effect on the packaging. And then this is what it looks like. So it has two different blushes. This is the Radiant Orchid blush, and this is just like a really pretty peachy, corally pink blush. And then this is the highlight, and the highlight is gorgeous. I put it on a client today and it was like, bam. So definitely excited about that. And that's going to be it for this vlog. I hope you guys have a wonderful week and I love you lots.